going on guys it's been a while but we are officially back at the racetrack as you can see we got midnight right here behind me she is already giving us issues she does not want to fire up we have not figured out what the reason is we're gonna go ahead and check the timing on her we're gonna put some new plugs in it and try to get it to fire back up because it is just spitting big old gobs of fuel and fire right out of the top of the carburetor we also got james back there and we got dr tunamall He's back there putting the tune up inside the car right now. Twisted T, James gonna be back there letting that button loose here soon to get ready for that thing. All right guys, so we got both cars up underneath the tent. Right here, you can tell the plug is just fouled. Look how wet it is. That's the reason why the thing won't fire up. We're gonna put a new set of plugs in here. I can tell you this is gonna be a job. There's very little room. I have fat hands, it's gonna be hard. Eric, you gonna try to attempt to take the plug out? Try to see if you can get them two boots off your rear. It's not fun. Let's head over here real quick. Man, look at you. You look like a professional. Is it? Yeah, just the, you know, out here. Safety's first when you're racing, so you gotta make sure you're at least tight in the car. I hear Outside you. Of that. I don't think you're gonna go fast enough for seatbelts. Uh, I mean, we're gonna try. I hear you. What you got going on over there? I'm going over to tune up, just checking out what they got going on in here. Hell yeah. Setting it up. Uh, the proper way for these injectors and stuff uh, should be a should be a little bit better. Hell yeah! Bet on that tree. What do you want to bet on? All right, let's do this. Let's bet a hundred dollars. Whoever cuts the best light. Hundred on uh, the tonight. Tree. There's three rounds. Hundred on the tree. Hundred on the tree. Whoever cuts Lock. the best light. Lock. So we got three rounds, boys, to be able to see who cuts the best light. You got the TKM power plant right there. You got the four seduction 88 millimeter turbo on the front of it. We got the big block Chevy over here. Let's go ahead and get with it, boys. You heard it right there. First locked in between us two right here. Whoever cuts the best light for $100. Well, we officially have figured out that it is not fun working on one of these cars. Now we're having to take the header off just so we can get the goddamn spark plug out the rear. Well, Tony said he ain't gonna be doing this every round. <laughs> what James say? We they built the header tubes out of the fence post. He's <laughs> done something, man. That bitches look rough, dude. I need. I'm gonna get a new set of headers built. I'll, get, I'll hit up Cameron Johnson and let him do them. Why don't we build zoomies, but just straight out the hood? So Like tractor pull stuff. Yeah, like tractor. We'll Hell put yeah. flaps up top so <laughs> no rain man. can go down in them. Hell yeah. Hey, you damn sure wouldn't have no problem getting the spark right. plugged in. <laughs> that thing will just come right out. Up. Done and over with. You don't you need no more downforce. Well, right now, you wouldn't be able to make a round <laughs> working on this thing, man. Oh, that thing's a pain in the ass. Yeah. You got to push it down. Push the front end down. The hood. No, no, down there at the end. There you go. Yeah. I know you got you got the high end pro mod out. shit. I don't. We don't I run can't, hoods. I can't afford. It. They usually fly. I see you don't run wheelie skis either. No. <laughs> can on them unibody cars. Golly. Good now? That's why we needed to check that shit. Right, yeah, I'm good. Unplug this timer like us. So does that mean that mean he gets he gets gap tonight? I mean I just I'll have another six degrees timer if I don't change it on It'll really run slow. So when it's got, already you got gap more is what he's saying. Say it again? You would have got gap more. It'd have been a bigger gap, it'd have been train links. Yeah, rather than car links. I'm ready to let this thing rip. Hey, is the white car ready? It's fueled up, ready to go. Oh yeah, we're good. 
Hey man, who, what's going on today, man? I'm just out here, got me another rental ride for the weekend. Look, Shake look. this thing down for old Swanstrom, see what we can do with this here uh, LS turbo combo he's got. Man, you know, he, he talking some trash about that black car. You think you go uh, put it to him? Dude, I seen you see them headers on there made from the schoolyard's fence posts. You know, you can't be having that out here. You can't be having that out here. You're right, them headers do look terrible. He's going to possibly put a hot tune in that thing and blow a hole right through that thing. <laughs> yeah, how many passes did he go get out of it? Oh, he'd be lucky he gets two. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, good luck today, bro. Country, what we got going on today, man? Man, we got full racks of ribs up there already, ready to go. Man, what kind of grill is this, first of all? Man, that's a homemade country bumpkin country grill, what that is. <laughs> there you go. Hey, hey, show me the thing with the shelf. Look, look at this, y'all. Oh! <laughs> Listen, my rec tech don't do that, and he got a Yoder. Is it a Yoder or... Once, yeah. once I got in the house, I yoder. Yeah, my red tail is yoder don't do that. This grill right here I made for Miss Kim. This, miss, this is Kim and Tony grill. Okay. Uh, we got full racks just sitting over here. Let me see. It's been on about an hour. Ooh. Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm going to go ahead and pull that out. You going to eat that? Yeah, we're going to try it. All right. <laughs> he got all types of features on it. Look, this over here, he got the, got the, the wheel pull bar right here with the, with the big tires on it. Man, we got country out here oh, getting yeah. it in. This we're, bitch here ready for the racetrack. Man, we get. Hey, what you cooking tomorrow? Uh, well, tonight I'm going to put a couple pork butts on there tonight. I'm going to put a brisket on there tonight. They will run about 15 hours, so they'll be done sometime tomorrow. Ooh. We got ribs, pork chop, fish. Ooh. Huh? Got a brisket. A brisket. Yeah. brisket? Yeah. Man, we about to eat good, y'all. I've ever heard in my life. How, how long we been cooking? Uh, about two hours, 15 minutes. All right, let's see what we got. Let's Run them at 225. 225. They ready, though. All right. Oh, my God. Know they ready. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Hold on. <laughs> you said they're real. See, Woo! When, see when they band like that, dog? Yeah. Is, that, is, that what we, is that what we're looking that's for? That's all you got to look for. When they band like that, that's a rib test. All them guys that are cooking them ribs that they say fall off the bone, yeah. they just overcooking the shit and they don't know what to do it. Uh oh. Because if you let it keep cooking, it'll fall off the bone. The shit's all dried up. Okay. What we skin with. Okay. What we fit in the cut with. Now, Jay, you got to go and cut them because they're done. So if you don't cut them, if you don't cut them, they'll continue to cook. Oh. Oh, for real? Yeah. That's a good tip. That's a good tip.
Hey, what you think about being down here in Florida right now? How first, nice of it? Man, first of all, it's beautiful. Food's good. Food's fantastic. Racing shit right now. It's it's gonna get better. It's gonna get better. It's gonna make it better. First, first pass was rough. Yeah. James right there, he uh he drove through the beam, so I'm already one up on him on the tree. Hey, make sure you have my hundred dollars. Iron it for me. 037 light. Look at that. 037. Look at it. He's at double low. So, hey, you know what loses his first round? Anything slower than a double low. <laughs> so you're all good now? Everything's set? Yeah. So uh, they went up there, had some malfunction in the wiring and all that, but uh, drove through the beams, wasn't able to uh, hold it up on the two-step. We were just all the way jacked up. We uh, were running real fat. But uh, we're fixing that right now. We also found out that we can't use the spark plugs I normally use because they are hitting the pistons. So we're putting the old ones uh, back in it. Well, brand new plugs, but the older sets, uh, it's not the same spark plugs that I use. But uh, both units are up and going. We are getting ready. We're gonna go up for round two. Me and James got a $100 bet right now. I am in the lead with a 037 light. I'm gonna try to go better, try to go faster. Midnight right here ran very well. Let's see what Twisted T can put down.